In this video, I'm going to show you how to search for open profiles on LinkedIn. Identifying open profiles on LinkedIn is really interesting because you can basically send them free emails so you can skip the connection request step and get your message to land directly in the main inbox of your prospect without spending an email credit. But unfortunately, there is no way to filter open profiles on the LinkedIn basic search here nor on a uh, LinkedIn sales navigator search filter. So you got no way to filter open profiles using the LinkedIn search engines. And obviously I guess LinkedIn is doing that to protect them from spammy LinkedIn prospecting messages. So there is no open profile filter on LinkedIn or sales navigator, but right now I'm going to show you a technique that will allow you to detect who among your lead list are open profiles. And this technique involves extracting the data from Sales Navigator into a CSV using the Evaboot Chrome extension. So to download the extension, you have the link in the description and in the first comment of the video. Once you have downloaded it, you will have a new button here, extract with Evaboot on your lead list and also on your lead searches. For this example, we are going to take a lead list and I'm going to click on extract with Evaboot here and it's going to open the Evaboot uh, platform. Then I just need to name a search here. I'm going to name it open profiles and click on extract. And then after a few minutes, you will have all the information available on LinkedIn search navigator for profiles and company pages into a clean CSV file. So to save your time, I've already extracted some searches and I'm going to download this file here and we're going to see who is open profiles among the people in this list. Okay, so I've uploaded the list into Google Sheet. For that, you just need to click on file import, upload, and there here, drag and drop your file. Uh, once you have done that, you see the Evaboot file here with all the information, first name, last name, clean, position, company name, website, industry, number of employees, etc. And if you scroll on the right, you are going to see a column prospect is open profiles with dimension false or true. So obviously when uh, there is a true, the prospect is open profile. And now we are going to filter this column on open profiles. So for that, I'm going to click on the little icon here, the little filter, then click here and then uncheck false and click on OK. And here I got only the truths left. So I have all the people in my list that are open profiles. So in just three clicks, you have been able to identify the open profiles on your list. So like I said, it's not able to filter open profiles directly on LinkedIn Sales Navigator, but using Evaboot, you are able to detect the open profiles among your lead lists. Once you got this information, what you can do is separate your prospecting campaigns in two groups, one for open profiles and one for regular profiles. The benefit of doing that is that you are going to save some connection request credits. As you know, connection requests are now limited to 100, 200 per week and by identifying open profiles and sending them free emails directly, skipping the connection request step, you are saving connection request credits for other leads. This means that you are able to contact more people in a shorter time frame. That being said, it's not because you can send free emails that you shouldn't be working on your copy. That's why I early advise you to watch this video here about how to generate leads on LinkedIn, where I talk a lot about how to write LinkedIn prospecting messages that get replies. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.